Hello wrestling fans, in this video I'm going to be breaking down the full roster that has been confirmed so far for WWE 2K22. I'm going to be looking at each trailer and other related promotional material to see what superstars have made the cut as of now. We are only going to be counting official announcements of these superstars, so whether they were seen in a trailer or announced via Twitter. We will not be including superstars based off their t-shirt appearing in the crowd. So, from the first WWE 2K22 teaser trailer which was revealed at WrestleMania 37, we got our first two superstars confirmed. Rey Mysterio, who looks to be a strong focus point of 2K22, featuring in his own 2K showcase mode where we'll be able to play through historic matches from his storied career. In the teaser, Rey hits the 619 on our second confirmed superstar, Cesaro. On May 10th, from pictures of an in-game scanning session, we got our first legend confirmed for the game, the nature boy Ric Flair. Ric Flair getting a new face scan is quite interesting, as it could potentially show that Flair may have a more current model available as a playable character. In recent years, we've been limited to classic versions of Flair, with an older version being limited to a manager role, although it is possible to glitch this, so you can use this version in matches too. The Nature Boy asked for his release from WWE back in August, and it was granted on August 3rd. Flair is no longer under contract with the company. Whether this requested release means that he has since been cut from the 2K22 roster remains to be seen. Flair's reveal was followed by another legend with Booker T, shown also being scanned for the game. Footage of Booker T and Ric Flair getting scanned by the 2K Tech was seen in the second 2K22 dev spot. On the same day of this 2K dev spot being dropped, we got our first women's superstar confirmed for 2K22. This time it came from Patrick Gilmore, a developer for the game, who invited people to guess who was the first superstar they scanned for 2K22. Gilmore tweeted on May 19th, 2021, To be ready to be scanned at a moment's notice, we actually built a second trailer and sent it to Orlando and Tampa. But first we had to test it in California. Who can guess which amazing superstar volunteered to help us test and became the first to be scanned for WWE 2K22. Many fans tried their luck at guessing the name, with many coming up short. The correct guess was later confirmed by Patrick to be in fact Bailey, thus making her the first superstar to be scanned for the game. Patrick was the source of another reveal just a few days later, replying to a fan who expressed their concerns of Randy Orton's in-game entrance. He said, I think you'll be happy with Randy Orton's entrance. Therefore, the Viper Randy Orton joins the lineup for 2K22. After this confirmation, we had around a three month wait before any more superstars got added to the roster. But when they finally did, we got a whole bunch of them. Hype began to grow as a promise of a reveal at SummerSlam was advertised for the event, with WWE 2K22 being the official sponsor of the biggest party of the summer. The WWE Games Twitter account actually gave us an early surprise posting two images of an updated model of Edge a few days prior to SummerSlam. Seeing Edge with a much needed update was a great thing to see, as a new model of the rated R superstar has been one of the most anticipated things for this release. This little teaser certainly got fans excited and whet the appetite for even more reveals at SummerSlam. The follow-up to this reveal was the WWE 2K22 SummerSlam trailer, which gave us our first real in-depth look at the game and also showed us 15 new roster additions. Those 15 were Bobby Lashley, Carmella, Dolph Ziggler, Drew McIntyre, Finn Balor, Goldberg, Kane, Kofi Kingston, Rhea Ripley, Ricochet, Roman Reigns, Sheamus, Shelton Benjamin, Shinsuke Nakamura, and The Miz. This trailer bolstered the roster a lot, taking our WWE 2K22 roster up from 7 to 22. Despite having many superstar reveals, everybody up to this point are superstars who previously appeared in a WWE game. We had yet to see a superstar who would be making their first appearance in the series. This would change with our most recent trailer, the WWE 2K22 hit list. This trailer showed off a load of new features and also a lot more superstars, 23 in total, with 5 superstars making their WWE games debut. Those 5 superstars who will be appearing for the first time in a WWE game are Austin Theory, Dominic Mysterio, Wacken Wild, Kaylee Ray, and Raquel Gonzalez. The trailer also gave us a look at MVP, 
who will be making his first appearance in a WWE game since SmackDown vs Raw 2011, and his first ever appearance in the 2K series. Other superstars seen in the trailer were AJ Styles, Apollo Crews, Asuka, Becky Lynch, Bianca Belair, Big E, Chad Gable, Jeff Hardy, Kevin Owens, Montez Ford, Mustafa Ali, Samoa Joe, Seth Rollins, Shayna Baszler, Tamina, Triple H and Tyler Bate. This takes our count for the full roster so far for 2K22 up to 45. So 45 superstars are confirmed as of now. I'm sure we'll get more in the coming months and hopefully despite some of the recent releases by WWE, 2K22 will manage to compile a great roster. It's looking pretty good so far. Superstars mentioned in this video were referenced from the Smackdown Hotel website and their 2K22 roster list. So if there are any you think I might have missed, please let me know. Also please note I chose not to include those that we haven't already yet had an obvious confirmation for. So that is why I chose to leave out the likes of Buddy Murphy and those superstars who have t-shirts visible in the crowd. So what are your thoughts on the way the roster is looking so far? And who are you hoping to see revealed next? Let me know your thoughts in the comments, make sure you drop a like on this video, and until the next one, thanks for watching.